Here's how you can graph the line and write the equation for when we have slope of three and a y-intercept of negative two. So to do that, let's look at the y-intercept first. So we have negative two. What that means is if we go to the y-axis here, we're gonna find negative two. That's where our line is gonna cross the y-axis. Next, we look at slope. So we have a slope of three. If we think about that as three over one, we can consider it rise over run. So now we go back to our y-intercept here. We're gonna rise one, two, three, and we would run one to the right. From there, we do it again. Rise one, two, three, and run one to the right. And you can see we have these three points. Let's put a line through that. Then we'll put arrows to show it goes to infinity. So this is the graph of the line with slope three and y-intercept of negative two. If we wanted to write the actual equation, we could use slope-intercept form, y equals mx plus b. So we have y equals m, that's the slope, that's three, put an x there, plus b. So b, the y-intercept is negative two, so we're just gonna say negative two, minus two. And the equation for slope three, y-intercept negative two is y equals three x minus two, and this is our graph. This is Dr. B, thanks for watching.